Welcome to my third installment of the Hot Wheels Keychain Spy Cam series. Uh, to show you a little bit more of what's going on here, uh, got the two 2007 re release from Target, which are now no longer they're discontinued cars. Got the truck and the super spoiler. And behind here is the Spy Cam Keychain Chassis. And uh, if you notice in here, the screen battery didn't come with this Hot Wheel. Uh, usually you get a yellow one that's a 150 milliamp hours. This one I kind of stumbled across. It's a one third double A 300 milliamp nickel instead of a NICAD that comes with the Sizzlers. I've charged both of these up, the regular one and this one up with an equal amount of time of 90 seconds. And the green one here, believe it or not, ran five times as long as the one that came with the Sizzlers. So with that being said, I mean, they were upside down freewheeling. Uh, no Sizzler goes on for as long as they do, but this one, the green one with the green chassis, the can chassis car, actually ran for almost an hour. It was unbelievable and I uh, got pretty tired keeping score with it, but uh, quite impressed. But uh, what happened was a guy had, I had bought some Zip Zaps on eBay some zip zap like wannabe clones and uh, every one of them was busted up and they weren't every one was corroded and all the batteries were gone and he kindly refunded me so uh, I took that money and bought these batteries thinking they would fit a zip zap or a micro sizer or something like that but uh, to my uh, enjoyment actually is that it fits the sizzlers which I would prefer anyway uh, fixing to hop over to bigger things this year and Gonna be glad to be turning you guys on to them. If you really enjoy this channel, and you want to subscribe to it. We're into the infant beginnings here, so uh, hop on the wagon, <laughs> hang on for dear life, because uh, these cars go actually what I've been reading online is six miles per hour, and six miles per hour, if my math is right, these are 164th cars. You add that up, and I get a total of 184 miles per hour scale. So, as you see on these videos, it does go by pretty quick. So, uh, with all that said, and all that rigmarole, oh yeah, by the way, I uh, made a big mistake with cleaning my track with armor all. Don't do that. <laughs> made it real slick and slippery, and there's all kinds of junk sticking to it like a magnet. So it looks good for about five seconds, and that's what armor all is good for five seconds and uh, then it just starts attracting dirt like a magnet it's just garbage stuff don't ever use it <laughs> something I've learned and uh, anything I learn I'm gonna pass it on to you but uh, let's get ready to rumble here we go